Island, but what are you going to be doing for lunch and for dinner? Perhaps you're tired of playing cook, baker, or master griller. It's time to take the family out, maybe for a good burger or just to pick one up. And good timing, because guess what? Today is National Hamburger Day. And joining us to share and celebrate both the grilling tips is Farmer Boys Executive Chef Fred Slater. Fred, how are you doing? Good morning, Eric. How are you guys doing out there? Great, great. Hey, I've been spending a lot of time on the grill trying to uh, perfect my hamburgers. I recently fried them uh, because I've been marinating <laughs> so much that I had some flare up. Um, so I'm looking forward to your tips on how to avoid that and how to make the perfect burger here on National Hamburger Day. Yeah, we can definitely get to that in a second. So what do you got there in front of you there? And how can we be celebrating National Hamburger Day? Well, how we're celebrating today is we're giving away 2,000 of our Big Cheese hamburgers. Um, what better way to celebrate than that? Um, all you have to do as one of our guests come on in, you're going to scan your receipt through our VIF, which is our very important farmer app. And then uh, we're going to send you a free Big Cheese offer. So what better way to celebrate? That's a, that, what a great way to celebrate. You know, growing up as a kid, hamburgers, cheeseburgers, not much to them. But show us what you got there in front of you because these burgers are like a meal now, Fred. They are. They are huge. We have our farmer burger here, an award-winning farmer burger, half pound of beef. And actually, we're going to make this one in the back for you in a second. And this is the one that we're going to be giving away 2,000 of is our big cheese. And, of course, our always crispy fries and fresh produce. Fresh produce is one of the keys. Right. I just sampled one of those fries. They're delicious, by the way. Uh, so tell us what what makes the good burger? I mean, the meat and the, where you get the meat from. I know that's special to farmer boys. Absolutely. I'm going to walk as we're doing this as well. So we're using 100 percent USDA beef um, and the quality of the product is very important. We want to make sure we start with a great quality product and then we're going to end with a great product at the end. So here we're using 100 uh, percent, like I said, USDA beef. And uh, we're going to start with our patties. And the temperature is the key here. Um, you want to make sure that your grill is at least 400 to 450 degrees. Okay. That's important because it's going to sear the meat. Right. Once we sear that meat, we're going to sear all the juices in there. So that's how we're going to get that perfect product. And, of course, produce. Um, and actually, I'm going to put the burger here together for you. Um, we source our own local buns. Um, and we're gonna put our house made. We make this every day, Thousand Island dressing. I should mention you guys, are, with the whole COVID thing, you guys are open, right? We are open, that's right. Okay. That's right, we are open for drive-through and uh, hopefully soon we'll be open for in-dining as well. Gotcha. So that's coming up. Uh, see. Yeah, we throw it all on tomatoes. there. While, while you're doing that, the Great American Takeouts Burger Bash event, how is that whole thing gonna work? Uh, well, like I said, what we're going to do is we're going to give away the 2000 All you have to do is come on in, scan your EIF uh, receipt, and then uh, we will be sending you the, uh, the free offer. Oh, got it. So that's, so okay. that's, so that's the, the name of the promo. Got it. People. Awesome. That sounds, that sounds great. What was the last thing you put on there on that burger? You, you slapped some other goodies on there. That's going to be the hand-smashed avocado. We actually are <laughs> smashing avocados every day in the restaurant. Um, fresh, like I said, fresh produce is, is the key yeah. and locally sourced for us at the restaurant. But you know, the, honestly, the best thing is I just made the perfect burger for you. So why even spend the time at home? Just come I was just going to say, uh, have one at Farmer Boys. Yeah, Fred, no more flare ups for me. I'll just leave it to the pros. I'll stop by your place next time. Uh, you sent some burgers to, to our station here. We're going to uh, do a cutaway of this shot here of the wonderful burgers you sent us, uh, as well as the onion rings and the fries here. It smells so delicious. Uh, what is your favorite burger, Fred, there? Because I know there's lots of different options. Definitely right here, the Farmer's Burger. This is an award-winning burger for us. And uh, with all of the fresh produce, fresh beef, the locally sourced bun, it's definitely one of my favorites, and it's an excellent, excellent burger. Okay, so where can people learn more about this, uh, this, this great deal you guys got going on? What's the website? Where can people learn more about your great services? You can go on farboys.com or just come on to one of the restaurants and uh, download the VIF app, and you can get all the information there as well. Fred, thanks so much for your time. You have your mask on. Uh, thanks for doing that. But I can tell I you're salivating <laughs> while you're looking at that burger, just like we are. <laughs> That's a good-looking burger there. Thank you very much, guys. Thanks for your time, Fred. Really appreciate your time here today.
Um, you said it. It smells so amazing in here. Is it too here. early to just stuff no. your face with fries and burgers? Why don't nope. you just do it while I take it's the next It's lunchtime read. somewhere. It is. <laughs> just like it's happy hour somewhere. It does smell amazing. Their farmer burgers got bacon on it. Like you said, the hand smash avocado. Yes. And one of those has my name on it and one has your name on it. I know. I'm totally eyeing Maybe it right two. now. I noticed when they delivered this to us from the newsroom. Look at this shot right here. It, there was a burger missing. <gasps> Who is the who's Ooh. the burger culprit in the newsroom? David. Producer David's the one who delivered it, so I'm gonna. Uh, David, be we're him calling some you out. You know that's good because we're gonna be bringing these to the newsroom and everyone's gonna be enjoying it. The uh, few people that are in our newsroom. You right mean now. the three of us I here think right now? There's three. Yeah. <laughs>